of six in the regular season of our league. We have new guys here today. Top Gear AR12 and Red Fire Blaze is our new guy here. Uh, quick look. This is our standings that we are currently looking at right now. Schmidt and Ismo Kings have the win, so they're guaranteed for the playoffs. But they still need to fight for some points. Drift Kings there in third. That rounds your top three. That's your standings right now. And we're on Circuit the America's eight laps here. Uh, the track is going to look like I'm going to show you guys. Uh, this is what the track looks like. Uh, here's a little thing. To the Circuit of the Americas in Austin, Texas. The 20 turn track made its Formula One debut in 2012 and has hosted some great racing. Despite a long straight and some fast flowing bends, average speed here is 195 kilometers an hour, just below the season average. It has plenty of interesting elevation changes. It's quite tough on brakes and tyres and the prime overtaking spots are Turn 1 and at the end of the long straight at Turn 12. Let's go for Those are probably their best four heading into this race because their lap times are in the top 100 in the world. A few of them are in the top 50. We're going to go ahead and get it started here. See who's on pole in just a second. As we get started, Choki's on pole, Autobot second, Nismo Kings third, and fourth is Drift Kings, Schmidt and Eco in the back zone there, Choki zone. And a nice car. A lot of the guys here in the F50s. Uh, turn one is always hectic. And they keep it clean, surprisingly. Uh, we'll have to see how pit stops go. Uh, who will take it first, second, anyway, like that. Um, Choki Zone just sitting here in first place, just like he was last race. Let's head to mid pack. Let's go to Eco here. Or, sorry, that's in the back, but let's see how this is going to go. Drift King's back here. Eco going to go to the inside. Going to get a little bit crazy. But. Goes farther back. Schmidt now moves up to that seventh place. Let's go a little bit closer up here. Let's go to Derpy King in fourth place. Kind of single file as going right now. Autobot actually has the lead. That is a tough corner. This track is highly technical, especially for corner cutting penalties. And I'm surprised it's been clean so far. Derpy King and Nismo, or Nismo Kings, yes, uh, going at it right now. Let's see what happens going into the turn here. A little bit of contact. Now we are kind of on a long straight of this track. Let's go ahead and move it to the game cameras. On, we are currently on Derpy King here. Got a far lead behind him, but is he going to be able to go around Nismo Kings? They're both in the F50. We've got to make sure there's no contact here. Or someone will be getting a penalty. See what's going to happen as we go in. we got a big battle out there in the top three, and they keep it clean here. Let's go ahead and move over to Chiyoki Zone, who is currently sitting in second place. Right behind Autobot and right in front of Top Gear. And there's Nismo Kings. Uh, Autobot to having a great race so far. But here we have... Um, sorry, I forgot who we're on. I don't remember who we're on. But I think it's... Yeah, Choki Zone. He's the only one that is not in an F50. And he's sitting in second place right now. He's only a half a second behind. We're going to see what happens on the long straight here. Uh, right after this corner. We'll have to see who pits. I think Autobot will probably pit on the first lap. Who knows? Because you really don't want to get caught behind traffic on this track. Uh, Autobot's going to go in for his quick stop. Uh, we gotta, we're going to have a close thing right here. Make sure there's no contact. It's going to be good. Top Gear tried coming up on the inside. We're going to move over to Nismo Kings because he's going to have a little bit of drafting here. Yes, he does. Sorry, we're on Nismo Kings. We're on Top Gear. Let's go to Nismo Kings here. Not gonna. He's going to be too far away. And who's going to, no one's going to go uh, for the dive on their smart moves. Uh, Derpy King in the pits and Autobot in the pits. Those are who take, and so does Eco. So three drivers taking it on the first lap. That may prove that uh, maybe they want to get their clean air. Because like I said, it's very hard. As you see, Top Gear wasn't able to do his full racing line there because of uh, Chioki Zone. He didn't want to run to the back of him. And Nismo King's got to make sure he doesn't run into back of Top Gear. This is a close one heading in here in the uh, twisty S's here. Uh, I actually want to go to this track. It's actually very cool. Circuit America is an amazing track. And this is right now an amazing battle for the top spots. Schmidt is way back there. Uh, he's going to have to make up a lot of time here. Top gear with a very quick lap. We'll just see if anybody gets in those 216s like they were doing in practice. Uh, but I doubt it. Top gear is going to go for the pass on the inside. Let's move over to Chioki zone right now. Uh, he actually was able to complete the pass there as Top Gear tried to go under him. Let's move over to Top Gear now. We're on the large straight. See what happens with Top Gear. He's gained four positions since the start of the race. Good job for him. This track has a lot of action to it. 
Both these guys coming in very close in after the uh, long straight here. I don't really know the names of the corners here. If they even have names. I'm sure they do, but uh, I do know Lime Rock, so get ready for that one. Uh, we'll be heading to Hockenheim after this, I believe. Uh, so, top three, all within a close range of each other. All within about 100 feet-ish, uh, as you see here. Very good, and then you got Schmidt back there in fourth. So, I would move over to the other guys right now, but there is this is an amazing battle that we're having right now. Uh, with Top Gear and Auto, no, Autobot, sorry, not Autobot. He's sitting in sixth. Uh, he was able to kind of, we'll have to see if the undercut works for him. Because we'll have to see if he comes out in front. I think he will because all these guys are fighting. Choke Zone's going to go into the pits there. Uh, let's go look over to Nisbo King, see what he's going to do. He is going to go to the pits as well. Sorry, I think he was the one who went to the pits. Yeah, Top Gear and Nismo Kings head to the pit so let's go ahead and look over to autobot let's see if he's going to come out in front of any of these guys go ahead and head over to the game cameras it's going to be close it is a 45 second pit stop here um very long pit stop so if the undercut worked we'll have to see if autobot comes out in front i think he will because he's had all this time under clean air i don't know if he's made a mistake uh, during the lap that he was with the undercut, uh, but we'll have to see here. He actually ran two laps with the undercut. It's going to be close. Uh, he's still sitting here. I don't see the guys coming out of the pit stops just yet. Yes, there is one of them. we got to make sure there's no contact here. It's going to be close. He does get ahead of Nismo Kings, so he got that for him. Undercut worked on him, but... Uh, did it work on anybody else? I'm not sure. I think Nismo's the only one that pitted there. No, Nismo wasn't the only one that pitted, did he? I thought, um... No, I thought... Hmm. Yeah, I thought we had nine people in this race. Someone must have lagged out. No, huh. Um, I thought more pit, but apparently not. Let's go ahead and look over to Schmidt. We haven't seen him throughout this race. Uh, kind of missing a mind of his own right now. Good for him. Do we still have a battle here for top two? Yes, we do. So these two guys still need to pit. Uh, that's I do know that as of right now. Great battle here. I think both of these drivers have a great chance of taking the win here. Especially for uh, top gear. Uh, this is his first race. So it'd be amazing if he can get a win here. That'd be amazing for him. No livery though. It doesn't really matter. Uh, I don't know. If, if, I am, if I'm top gear right now, I'm going to go for the pit. Because uh, on a lot of the straights, where he has to break a little bit earlier, so he doesn't run uh, behind uh, Autobot or not Autobot um, Choki Zone. So I think for him it'd be best to just take a pit here, unless Choki Zone's gonna take a pit. Then I guess he can go for the overcut or whatever. And Choki Zone will take a pit. So yes, uh, Choki Zone does take the pit there. Well, to keep track on him, Top Gear's just gonna run there. Let's look at uh, Schmidt. See kind of what he's doing here. don't think he's taken his I don't think has he taken his pit stop I'm not sure uh, let's go back to Drift Kings let's see what's gonna happen with him will he take his pit stop heading in here he's in the F50 Kitsun power that is uh, let's see if he takes his pit stop actually I think he did take his pit stop I wish I could see there, there needs to be a thing where you can see uh, if the person's taking their pit stop or not so let's go to uh, what should we go here let's go to Autobot Autobot and Drift King, or Nismo Kings, passed Autobot, so uh, that's now good for him. Uh, 45 second pit stop, so uh, we'll have to see how this plays out. Choki Zone is 39 seconds ahead, so I don't think AR-12, or not AR-12, Top Gear is going to come out in front of any of these guys. Let's see about Schmidt, I'm not sure if he's taking his pit stop once again. I don't think he has, because he was kind of far back behind uh, Nismo Kings and such, so I don't think he's taking his yet. Let's look at Autobot here, uh, see if he's still battling. Uh, not really. These guys are kind of just uh, settled in right now uh, at their positions. We'll have to see what happens later on in the race. Uh, we're going to be close here to see if Top Gear comes out before Nismo Kings. I've done the whole view the other way this time, so let's check it out from the pit lane view here. This is going to be close. I see the guys coming back there. I don't think he's going to get out in time. It's going to be close. So Top Gear, go ahead gotta make sure that he doesn't cause any interference and he is gonna come ahead of Nismo Kings as for now but he gets stuck there on the outside let's see what happens here let's go to the game cameras or replay cameras. sorry it's close 
It is going to be a good one here, but Top Gear is in front of Nismo Kings as for now. So close right now. Nismo Kings is going to go to the outside. Uh, once again, trying to make sure that they do not track extend or corner cut. This is a great battle for the top three right now. Look at that. Nismo Kings right next to him. Let's go over to Nismo Kings right now. He is right on the side of that uh Right on the side of that car there. Goes a little bit to the outside. Autobot right behind and Shioki Zone right behind as well. We are going to have a great end to this race here. We are halfway through on lap 5 of 8. All these drivers here are taking the corner fairly easy. Let's. I, I, I want to change over to Schmidt right now. Uh, but it looks like he's got a 25 uh, second lead here. So he's going to come out behind all these guys after the pit. So not the best race for him as of right now. But... Let's see what happens here, heading into the uh, long straight, or after the long straight, heading into that corner, see if anybody's going to overbreak. Autobot's got to make sure he doesn't crash, he keeps it, almost locks up. Actually, I think he did lock up, but barely doesn't touch Nismo King, so great clean racing there. That, that was legal because he had two wheels on the track at least, so we're good for him. And I'm not sure if Smith is going to take his pit, I don't think he did. Um, everybody though has taken their pit stop except Schmidt so we're gonna be all settled here for the final part Nismo Kings with the 217 as of right now uh, I don't think it shows fastest lap I wish it did I don't think it does though yeah it doesn't show it well look what happens after this lap top gear it's a little bit too much curb on that one. Let's see if Nismo King's going to improve his lap time. Uh, and he, nobody else really in that uh, area of, like, really quick. Nismo King's a 218. Uh, I don't know what happened to, to Rift Kings. Let's see what happened to him. Go back to loop data. I believe that's Nismo King's out of the race. I think he lagged out again. I think he's just going to save it for last. Uh, so let's see what happens here. He always has this uh, orange and blue livery. It's an amazing livery, actually. Kind of looks like the McLaren Formula 1 team. Eh. His lap times still aren't as fast. They're two seconds slower right now than the uh, than the other two, being Top Gear and Autobot. So Drift King's 10 seconds faster on that one for him. He's currently in third place in the championship. Not the best race uh, so far, yes. Yeah, so here goes, here goes uh, Schmidt here. Let's move up to Top Gear. We're gonna head up to the replay cameras and see where these guys are gonna come out. I'm pretty sure Schmidt is going to be far back. Actually, let's go ahead and move back to Chioki Zone because he'll probably be closer with him. I think he's gonna land in that uh, nowhere zone between Derpy and Chioki Zone. But we'll have to see here. Let's go over to Schmidt. He is currently in that pit stop. Still taking his pit. Yep, there goes Top Gear. There goes Autobot. And there goes Chioki Zone. So, I think he... We'll have to see if he even comes out before um, Derpy King. I don't know where Derpy's at. Nah, he's going to come out way before Derpy King. So, he's going to miss the podium, it looks like. Let's head back up to the top three. Let's see how this final lap's going to go. Pretty sure it's just going to stay the same here. It's kind of what it looks like with Chioki Zone getting third. It'd be good for him. Autobot there in second or first place over there. So I don't, I don't think it's going to change at all. I think we're, I think we're stuck like this. Uh, overall, this was a really good race, I think. A lot of overtakes, uh, kind of. I mean, it was all really, really close just until these final laps here. Everybody kind of got their own distance. Let's head up to the race leader, Top Gear. This is going to be his first race in the championship, and he's going to he's gonna get the win, it looks like. As long as no mistakes happen, he's going to make sure that he does not get a mistake. Uh, meanwhile, Nismo King's missing out once again. I think he probably could have got a podium. He's looking like he was about to get a podium. Uh, but no doubt that the top three drivers were all really, really good here. So congratulations to Top Gear Arrow 12. Looks like he's going to take this one. Second place will be Autobot unless Chokizone somehow catches up. Chokizone in third. 
Fourth place would be Schmidt. Fifth place will be Derpy. Yes, at sixth Eco. Seventh Drift Kings. Eight Nismo Kings. Unfortunately, with that lag out. Uh, pretty sure this one's over for the first place, but let's. Uh, was it? Uh, he got crashed. So Schmidt actually in fourth place. Surprising for him. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it. The other guys don't end up finishing the race. Uh, so now I'm going to give you guys the new standings here. Uh, so now for the playoffs. Um, for the playoffs, now we do know that we'll have Schmidt, Nismo Kings, and Top Gear Era 12. There's still three possible positions. Now, so the thing is, those three guys are guaranteed, but there's still three open positions. But say we have a new winner every race, then therefore all the those will be the six drivers. But like Autobot right now hasn't won a race, but he's the best one who hasn't won a race yet. So he's still sitting in fourth place. It's going to be good. There's still three races left in the regular season. Once again, if you want to join, really this is probably the last time you can join after this. Uh, so yeah, that's the end of this one, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the race. Make sure to leave a like, share. See you guys next time.